Hello everybody, Romin is here with Pitsy Dusty Design Channel. I hope you are doing well. I'm going to show you how to assemble hexagon nativity ornament bot die by Pitsy Dust Design. I hope my pronunciation as well, but if you don't, you understand. I don't speak English for a long time, or so it's very difficult for me some words. Please forgive me. I hope to explain everything as clear as possible but if you have any question please leave me them in the comment below and i will happy to answer them first of all i want to show you how each of the die cuts look on paper so you can get an idea of how to ensemble them it's actually quite interesting and simple every though uh, there are many different pieces each one has the detail that indicate where it's go trust me it's very intuitive but if you have any doubt please watch the video closely i'm going to tone down the solid color of the paper and reduce the saturation using distress ink uh, vintage to give the project a uh, look like vintage sorry <laughs> this is something i personally love to do but it's not necessary if you prefer the original tone I think it's giving nice a uh, look. Next, I will glue in each of the piece together. Uh, I want to split this part in English because it's quick technique, um, but I believe the video shows in detail how to ensemble each piece to form the bots. The important thing is to score each folder line while we unfollow the guide created by the die on the paper.
One Pisces advice I would like to give you is to use a slow driving glue so you can work with the paper more easily and use medium weight paper to I don't know the, the, the expression but you can use the paper more easily and glue each piece together slowly so it's truly a beautiful ornament for the Christmas tree or center pies or even of a gift you can I like change the color, uh, maybe use for a car. Many uh, projects and idea you can use this die to create. If you want to find it, I invite you to visit the uh, brand's website. I leave all the link, all the product, and I use in the description box below. So if you can easy access. This is the video I have prepared for you today. I hope you enjoy it. If you uh, like, please give me a heart. And um, don't forget to subscribe to the channel. I'll leave some link at the end of the video to other projects uh, for inspiration. I also invite to you follow us on all social media. See you in the next video. Bye bye.